Hi everyone, welcome back to the Node.js tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about handling the POST request. POST and GET are two common HTTP requests used for building REST APIs. Both of these calls are used for some special uh, purpose. GET requests are used to fetch data from a specified resources and uh, POST are used to submit data to uh, a specified resources. Express version 4 and above require extra middleware uh, to handle the POST request. This middleware is called as body parser. So let's install uh, the body parser. So go, go to the command prompt and here just type in pm install body parser. Alright and press enter. Alright, now we have to import uh, this package in our project. So, and uh, tell Express to use this as a middleware. So, go to the index.js file and just click on index.js file. And here, just write here const body parser is equal to require and inside the require, just pass here body as parser all right now configure express to use body parser as a middleware so just write here here app dot use and inside this just pass here body parser dot url encoded and inside the URL recorded, just pass here the object extended colon true. Uh, sorry, false. All right. Also add here app dot use body parser dot JSM okay all right now we can use app dot post ex, uh, express route router to handle post request okay so first of all create a gate route for showing the page so just write here app dot gate and inside this gate just pass the uri which is login i am just going to create a login page and just here for request and response okay and just response dot render and render login view okay so just right here login now let's create a login view so go inside the views folder and just right click and new file and file name let's say login.ejs okay now copy all text from the contact dot contact.ejs file so just copy copy all and co uh, select all and copy and go to the login.ejs file and just press paste here is the title login and here login page okay now inside the body just add a form here so just write here only write here login okay now create a form so just write here form <laughs> method post action and just close the form now create two field one for the email and second password so just write here form group and create a label for the email all right and just write here the email as a label 
create the input field input type is equal to email class form control id is equal to email all right now create another group so just write here dot form form group and inside this group just create a label for the password okay just write here the label password now input type this time password is the type is a password class form control this is the class of bootstrap 4 okay and id password all right finally create a submit button so just write here button type is equal to submit and class dtn dtn primary okay i just pass here the text submit all right now uh, let's uh, check this so go to the command prompt and just run the index.js file press enter now go to the localhost 3000 and login page you can see here the login okay login page now uh, create the post route so go to the index.js file and here after that just write here app dot post and uri let's say uh, login call away function request to response and inside this just pass here uh, create a variable email the email is equal to request dot body dot email okay get another uh, variable for the password so just write here password is equal to request dot body dot password all right now just response dot send this email and password so just write here email is equal to this concatenation sign email okay uh, give some space and just write here the password password is equal to concatenation sign password All right now go to the login.ejs file js file and just add the action here so just write here slash post sorry post tree login okay because this is login right so just write here login now save the file and let's check so go to the command prompt and just rerun the index.js file now it's running on local 3000 so go to the browser and just refresh the page all right now fill email id let's say zenifer at the rate gmail.com and password one two three four five six seven eight okay now click on submit you can see here okay all right email and password undefined let's see okay just add here the name 
name email and password sorry name is equal to password all right now save the file and again rerun the index.js file so just type here node space index.js press enter now go to the browser and just click and refresh the page and re-enter the email id so just write here jennifer at the rate gmail.com password 12345678 okay just click on submit this time you can see here email id is equal to jennifer at the rate gmail.com and password is 12345678 okay so in this way you can handle the post request so that's all about handling the post request so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching